Good afternoon and welcome to Rockstar UK. Um, something a little bit different for you this time. Um, we've got three products which have been kindly given to us by uh, Jay's Wax. Um, got in touch and he's kindly asked us to review three products. So we've got, first of all, we've got Shiny Garage Interior Detailer. So we'll give that a go. We've got Jay's Wax Bubblegum Ceramic Quick Detailer. So we'll give that a go. Um, I'm probably going to use that on the little Fiesta. And then we've got a nice little uh, like show wax, which this one smells a bit like um, banana like summer fruity, it's quite nice. Um, don't sniff it too much. So we've got three products. We've got uh, three vehicles. I've got a 2003 uh, VW Beetle convertible, which I'll probably use the interior detailer on. I've got a, a Mark VI Fiesta ZTEC S turbo diesel, which I'll probably try the quick detailer on. Then behind me, we've got the uh, my old Mark 1 Escort, and we'll use the show wax on that. Let's see how it goes. Unfortunately, I've had to uh, change over to my other camera because the other one just died. So, first of all, this is the uh, Fiesta. Right, it's just been washed. It's been uh, like wiped down. You can see it's got reasonably good shine on it. So, uh, let's try the quick detailer and see what it looks like. So I like to do it in strokes, just in case there is any grime on the panel. Give it a quick wipe off. It smells fantastic. I mean, if I could have smell of vision, I would. Um, so just wiping the panel down, and then I think it said on the bottle to actually leave it for a little while. So, so no, avoid it on the skin. So that's the best way to apply it. With a soft foam pad, three to five minutes secure, allow it to dry. Or well, don't allow it to dry, sorry. But yeah, look at it, it's a beautiful pink colour, but it smells fantastic. And there it is, Jay's wax. So I'm gonna leave it a couple of minutes and then buff it off. Right, so I've just gone around it and buffed it all off after a couple of minutes of leaving it on and I'm really impressed with the shine it gives. Right, this is this is literally just my daily car so I wasn't expecting big results but I'm actually quite impressed with the so like the, the shine that it's given. I mean it, it smells really good, it's easy to apply and uh, yeah, it gives a good good finish. I'm quite impressed with it. I even I even did it on the glass cuz when you're at a show you know, I me personally don't really use a glass cleaner. I just use an, a detailer and yeah, I'm very impressed with that. So uh let's get on and use the uh Use this stuff, the uh, Shiny Garage Interior Detailer. And we're actually going to be using that on this 2003 VW Beetle. Alright, so I don't know if you can see here. There's some scuff marks. Just some general dirt and stuff that's on the back of the seat from having kids. So this is a 53 plate uh, VW Beetle convertible. So. I'm just about to try the shiny garage on the seat, so let's give it a go. Okay, so that was quite quite impressive. Literally, spray it on, and then I used just a clean 
microfiber, just give it a wipe down. And it does buff up quite nicely too, it gives you that nice sort of like, there's no like silicon residue or stuff, it's actually got a nice smell to it. And yeah, look at that. Nice and clean, nice and clean. Very impressive. This is my 1972 Mark 1 Escort. And we're going to try out the uh, the Jay's Wax Show Wax. So, as you can see, this panel is properly cleaned. We're going to try it on the boot and uh, see what sort of results it gives us. I'll try and spray a bit of water on the panel. We can see what beading it gives. And, uh, yeah, hopefully it impresses me. Because, obviously, as you can see, I'm an avid Auto Finesse fan. Um, the guys have treated me well, and uh, let's uh, let's hope this uh, this little pot of goodness lives up to it. Right, so there's no instructions on this little pot, but what I tend to do is leave it to cure, and then do a little swipe test. So when you're looking at it, you can't really see in this light, but if you wipe your finger across it, you see like that's still smeary. If it comes off clean when you swipe, it means the wax is cured and it's ready to take off. But I'm interested to see what the wax will do on this solid colour and uh, see what the shine it gives. As you can see, a bit better in this light. Do a swipe test. Nope, still smeary, so I'll give it 5-10 minutes longer and see, uh, see how it goes. So as you can see here, there's the wax and it comes off super easy and um, I can still smell it which is quite quite cool but there you go nice shine we'll see what the water beading is like in a minute as you can see here it's off completely buffed it off really impressed press with the uh, with the shine that it's given I just want to Probably needs a few more seconds to cure, but that's um, that's quite impressive. I mean, that is a that is a flat panel, so I'm not surprised that they're not running off quickly. But yeah, look, no streaks behind. Oh, it's starting to go again. Put a bit more, in so you can see. Yeah, very impressive. So, if you like the video, please give it a thumbs up. Uh, like, share, subscribe, all those good things. And we'll be bringing more products from Jay's Wax, hopefully. Um, but also, there's some shows coming up. So we've got Players Classics. We're going to hopefully get into Gravity Show. Obviously, there's the rebuild of the Ruckus, so that's coming on quickly. They're currently, the, the frames are in paint, um, and the engines are having a few trick bits done. So, uh, stay tuned, and I'll see you guys in the next video.